around 10,000 youths below the age of 45 from the nine states of the Niger Delta region will be benefiting from the NDDC Youth Incentive Scheme. Yesterday, the Niger Delta Development Commission officially launched the portal for enrollment in the Incentive Scheme. The scheme is designed to provide training in various fields, including agriculture, technology, craftsmanship, medicine, teaching, and entrepreneurship to equip young people for self-employment. Now, the NDDC Managing Director and CEO, Dr. Samuel Obugu, at the lunch ceremony in Patakot, River State, said that the Commission is committed to supporting President Bola Ahmed Tinubu's economic programs and youth development. Let's take a look. I'm using this video to reach out to company owners, the oil companies, to let them understand that the fear of the Niger Delta not being peaceful has been defeated. That even in the highest level of tension in Nigeria, the Niger Delta is the most peaceful place to be. There was no incident of anybody dying in the Niger Delta, no incident of vandalism. That is to tell you that the people of the Niger Delta, we have learned our lessons, and this is the time for us to embrace development. That does not mean that we don't understand that times are tough. Times are tough is not only in Nigeria. Inflation is a global thing right now. But for us in Nigeria, we know Mr. President is working very hard with his policies to address the challenges that are facing the citizens of this country. And we in the Niger Delta have chosen to give this government that chance by way of supporting this government and supporting its policies. The chairman, governing board, and the senior chair, David Bia, will have the criteria for enrollment. And so the portal is now open for application. We'll close in August 31st, 2024. We're overwhelmed. Like Oliver Twist, we say, 10,000 youth is much. But we also appeal as time goes. There's an age limit. We are not going to take a pass or uh, geriatrics or pensioners and then they come and hide under the youth scheme. If you're over 45, please do not apply. I beg of you, please do not apply because you are not too far from retirement age. <laughs> Leave it for the youth that will still have at least two, three decades of work life and active life. So please, let us develop our youth. Do not try and cut your age by 10 just so that you can get onto this program. Because when you do that, you will be denied the legitimate beneficiaries the opportunity to get on the program. So please, let us just be truthful and honest and leave it to those that fall within the age bracket. Also, persons living with disabilities, there will also be a special provision for persons living with disabilities. So I know that um, it probably wasn't highlighted there, but it's also some there's, there's, there's a, 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 um, a link or a category somewhere where that will highlight it if you're a person living with disability. Please just state whatever disability it is because we're also reserving a portion, um, a, a certain percentage for persons living with disabilities.